What was that? You found what you look for. Okay, let's do this. Hey! You! Hiding out there in the dark? Come out and face me! I'm Ko, son of Kobe. I came here to kick your butt and chew bubblegum. And I'm all out of gum. I've got to admit, I was expecting you to be more impressive. Come on then, let's end this. Right here, right now. How about terror kicks your butt? What are you doing here? Me? What are you doing here? 
Don't even try to stop me. I'm going to see Jayabaya now. No, I won't stop you. On the contrary, if you want to see him so badly, I'll take you right to him. Come on! So, you're now the hero you wanted to be, right? Hashtag save the jungle is trending now. <laughs> Maybe I should think about selling your merch instead of Jayavaya's now. No, thanks, but no. Mm, my offer won't be going anywhere. Maybe you should think about it. Brought any new gossip for me, thank you. Mm, nothing new yet, but I've got something a lot more interesting. I brought you your most devoted fan. He's dying to meet you. Oh, really? Well, let me ask you a question. Do you know what time it is? Time? Uh, uh, where's my watch? It's don't disturb me time. Right, right, but but maybe you could make an exception just this once. He's a... Uh... Keo, son of Kobe, your old friend. And I would like to speak to you. Kobe? I don't know anyone by that ridiculous name. But I do know those gloves of yours. Give them to me! Now! You want them? Come and get him.
remember him. Of course. I saw him shortly after I got this crystal from the Eternal Warriors, Acolyte. I remember that we argued about it. I'm not proud of that now. Do you know where you went after? I'm sure he went to see that crazy old goat. Walt, you should know who I'm talking about. Uh, uh, y yes, the, the oldest one. Uh, widely known, one of the best fighting masters. Uh, I, I, I know her. Yeah, sure you do, sure you do. What about my sister? Have you seen her too? No, unfortunately not. Maybe this elderly lady will know more. The oldest one, Kale. But don't let name mislead you. Speaking of names, the Eternal Warrior? Who is that? He's a maniac. That's who he is. I don't know what he looks like or what his true intentions are. But I know those intentions are no good. I mean, just look what he did to me. Still time. Can repair damage. Get yourself together. I will, I will. Milky, go and tell everybody that we need to clean up the mess that we made of our school. Immediately. On it, boss. I'd wish you good luck, kangaroo, but I feel that we'll meet again. Sure. I'm already missing you. However, I wish you both the best of luck. You'll need it. I'm sure you'll find Kobe, and when you do, please give him my regards. Thanks, Jaya. And good luck getting this place back together. Come. Time for a change of scenery. Frozen Mountains is the next stop. <laughs> Long time no see, Walter. Indeed, oldie. I see you have a new apprentice. Still in the old boring fighting business? Same business you were once devoted to. The world is changing. And of course, only you would stay the same. Ah, uh, enough of this. After all, you've finished your renewal, and I don't want to disappoint my clients. Let us fight then. We'll see if you've trained him well, Walter.
What were you thinking? Working with this e eternal warrior? I was convinced I was doing the right thing. I thought my school would benefit. Those crystals are really powerful, Walter. Yeah, tell us about it. So, Walter, tell me about this apprentice of yours. I can do it myself, thanks. I'm K.O., and I'm looking for my father and sister. They've both gone missing, and I'm sure this eternal champion person has something to do with it. Hmm. Not too long ago, I met another kangaroo. She was also keen to learn about the crystals. That has to be Kaya! She spent some time here. As bright as she was stubborn. She even learned spirit walking. Where is she now? I told her where the crystals come from, and that's where she went. The Isle of Eternity. Sure sounds like the place where we'd find the Eternal Warrior. Indeed, it does. I haven't been there myself, but I don't believe it takes a genius to put the two together. Okay then, let's go, coach. There's no time to waste. Good luck, Walter. I guess I'll see you around. Bye, Oldie. K.O. The journey ends. It has prepared you. Whatever you'll find there, you are ready, my young apprentice. Thanks for believing in me, coach. And don't stop believing. Because I really do feel that I'm ready. We've got your back, K.O. Now go and do what you're best at. Prepare yourselves for a marvelous show. Standing before you, we have the Mountain of Muscles. The Tower of Power. The Behemoth of Rome. Uh, no. It can't be. Dad, but I don't understand. I've been rooting for you, K.O., and waiting for this moment, your reunion with your dad. What's the problem? Aren't you glad to see him? What have you done to him? Oh, he did this to himself. He was stupid enough to come here without the gloves. And as you may have realized, I need them. Oh, right, right. We need them. So I guess I should thank you for bringing them here. Which one of you two is the Eternal Warrior? Because I'd like to speak with the boss, and I'm not sure who is who. I don't want to waste my time on any more minions. I am the Eternal Warrior, of course. You! I'm higher up than you! I'm literally above you! Well, we are! Because we are one, isn't that right? Good. Now that we've settled that, let's move to more pressing matters. The gloves. Astonishing. You were as crazy about us as you are, well, crazy. You see, Kale, while you might think that you've purified the hungry jungle or saved the frozen mountains, we don't care. Once we wear those gloves, the whole world will bow to us. That includes your pathetic island. We created the eternal power. That power belongs to us. Pardon me, but I would like to say that you are rather too bossy for my liking. Now that I think about it, I'm actually quite fond of where we are now. Thank you. Shush, you stupid thing. Come now, Kobe. Bring me the gloves and let's end this farce. Try not to worry, Cal. We will save him, even if it means we have to beat the snot out of him first.
how it was supposed to be. That's why your head is so light. It's empty. Dad! Dad. Sorry it took us so long. Are you kidding, Walt? You saved me. Not just me either, you saved the world. Well, these gloves are partially responsible for the success. Oh yes, I sure recognize those. Though it looks like you managed to tame them. We had our ups and downs, but I think we're on the same page now. I need to apologize to you all. Especially to you, my dear children. I was too naive and overconfident. I never should have come here on my own. You don't need to apologize, Dad. After all, you're the victim. I am the true victim! I just wanted to be a fighter, but they didn't give me a chance. No one! Not a single one of them! You're too weak! You couldn't hurt to fly! Well, I proved them wrong now, haven't I? Nothing justifies what you've done. You took revenge on whole world. No thought of consequences. Well, <laughs> it, it, it wasn't actually my idea. I'm not the one to blame. Oh, give me a break. This conversation is pointless. Let's go, everyone. It's time to leave all this behind us. It's never too late, you know. You can still become a real fighter if you do it the right way. You showed them all, son. Now any villain will think twice before considering to take over the world. Maybe we can hope, at least for a moment, that there are no more villains out there? Yes, that's a nice thought. We can surely hope so.